Thank you. My next testifier, uh, Madam Chair, will be Jeremy Sankey, uh, Minnesota Veterans for Cannabis. It looks like you're coming up. Please state your name again for the record and proceed with your testimony. Madam Chairwoman, this is Jeremy Sankey, Minnesota Veterans for Cannabis. Okay. Um, my organization is in uh, support of this bill. Um, we like the fact that um, the bill does improve um, access. Um, for many veterans in the state of Minnesota, access or accessibility is a very huge thing. Um, several veterans have to travel hours away uh, just to get to a dispensary. Um, can you imagine if you know you had to travel two hours to get to the local Walgreens to get your script filled by a doctor that was five minutes away from you? Um, this bill, um, although it doesn't address all the accessibility issues, does a lot. Um, there's a lot of, uh, with the increased manufacturing stuff in this bill, um, that could lead to uh, <clears throat> reduced prices or affordability for the program. Many of the things that veterans uh, struggle with is uh, being able to afford uh, the cost of the state program, um, which could be hundreds every month. And uh, they struggle with that because they know they can go back to the VA and get um, hundreds of pills for free every month. Um, so I want to thank Rep Representative Edelson on everything she's doing with this bill, and uh, hopefully we can get it through, um, do everything we can to help veterans, and at the same time, um, help as many civilians who uh, could benefit from the program. And um, I, I hope that if we can help more veterans, we'll be able to do everything we can for everybody. I mean, because that's why I became a veteran, that's why I became a soldier was to defend people who couldn't defend themselves. So if I can help, or if my organization can help to defend um, other people that can benefit from this program, um, we're all in. Thank you. Thank you for your testimony. 